What's up, guys? It's your boy, Charm to the Gamer here, back more Yu Gi Oh! Legacy to do episode 40, and it's time for us to do mind control on the reverse side. And after that, we'll have the Dark Spirit revealed, Awakening of Evil, Duel with Destiny, Clash in the Coliseum, Final Face Off, and then a new evil, Deja Duel, Fighting for a Friend, Grappling with a Guardian, Duel with Dart, and well, obviously the final duel. But anyway, those five are. The those five in gold there, those are DLC duels that we haven't actually done yet. Anyway, let's do this. Mime control, reverse style. Okay, it looks like I'll be going first, Barrel. Oh good, I'm drawing Slifer right away. And I'm also drawing the cards necessary to play Humanoid Worm Drake as well. <laughs> so come to me, Humanoid Worm Drake, in attack mode. It's funny, I actually have two copies of Slifer, even though in the anime Slifer is a one of a kind card. <laughs> but then again, this is the watered down effect version of Slifer. Oh! Okay, I gotta do that again because I have nothing on my field, nothing on my hand to protect myself, so... Gotta go again. That one didn't count because I just called BS on the fact that he had a great car. They're waiting! That's just not right! <sighs> it's not right! He had a great car all set up and ready to go in his hand! Not fair! You're not supposed to have that good of a troll! <sighs> there we go, that's what we're looking for. There's a charity, draw three, discard two. Set a card. Two cards. Alright. Now I'll play card of safe return. And infinite cards. Survival Jam, Defense Mode, and let the fun begin. And Destruction, so we discard two. I'll discard this guy and the Dark and Polymerization. Sword of Dealing Light, so Survival Jam face up. Fine by me. He's got a million face down cards. I probably know one of them is a Mirror Force. One of them's gotta be a mirror force, so I'll just set these two face down, just in case. Can't attack right now, so it's in my turn. At least he's gone through his entire... At least he'll wind up taking out before I do. That's important thing. So Revival Jam is reborn in defense mode for next turn. You can pick me off as much as you want with Merlin. Do shit to me. Alright, if safe returns effect, activate, letting me draw. And now I'll play another Rebel Jet in attack mode. See, but I can't just uh, direct the attack to the one attack mode and destroy Feral in that way. That would be nice and sneaky. <laughs> Ravagen's effect activates, pay a thousand to revive him, and then draw another card. Card of safe return, effect activates, let me draw. Humanoid Slime, defense mode! And now I can attack. Survival Jam's effect once again activates. Pay a thousand to revive him in defense mode, and then that lets me draw a card. Uh, 
Alright, I'll take my card, please. Slifer! Perfect! Problem is, he's probably got a face down. I don't like that. Now, I do have two cards to protect me, so what I'll do is go after him with one of these and see what he got, has face down first. Okay, now, attack! Let's reveal one of the face down cards. Okay, magic cylinder, I'll take 2,000. It's fine. I can deal with 2,000 damage. <laughs> Alright, your turn. Let's see what you do now. How dare you! You discarded Slifer from my hand! Hmm. Alright, Revival Gem. Activate your ability. Play a minute attack. Oh, okay, sacrificing. Bit of Dark Magician Girl. Clever. Very well. He probably only has one magic cylinder in his deck. So if I could bring out Slifer and blast his field, that would be nice. I've already got infinite cards in play. Okay, now. Card of safe return activates! I need to draw. Now. Call of the Haunted! Revive the mighty Slifer the Sky Dragon from my graveyard! Granted, it's only good for one turn, but that's fine by me. I have 7,000 attack points, and he's about to become 8,000 once I draw this card. Slifer attack! Actually, why don't I just attack with this instead? Hold it. Now I can bring it back and do you heavy damage. Be reborn, Slifer the Sky Dragon! And since I resurrected a monster from the graveyard, I get to draw another card. So, now I have nine cards in my hand. Slifer, attack again! Slifer, attack this one! Ah, okay, whatever. Now, main phase two, so I'll set it face down the field. So I can bring back Slifer again when needed. And now Nightmare Steel Cage, so he can't do anything to my arrival jams. So I formulate a plan. Slifer with the graveyard, that's fine by me. I didn't need him. He can't possibly have anything that can stop my, uh... Oh good, polymerization. Excellent. Now I can bring out Humanoid Worm Drake once I get this other call to haunt it off the field, of course. Why well, actually, once I get a free space. On the turn. Eventually, Slifer will come back with a vengeance and blast you to Smithereens, Pharaoh. And that eventually is now. But first, polymerization! I fuse humanoid slime with worm drake to form humanoid worm drake! She'll take care of your magician girl, and then Slifer will annihilate your life points! Okay, I have a feeling this is going to be the one. So let's bring him back. First we switch my Royal Gem into attack mode. Because I have a feeling we can wipe him out this turn. Because he doesn't probably have anything that can really stop my creatures. So, go! Call the Haunted! 
Be reborn! Slay from the Sky Dragon once again! I'm gonna get a call of haunted. Card of safe return activate, letting me draw another card. And I choose to play my Battle Breed that I just picked up. So I can draw two more and add to Slay for the attack strength. Giving him a grand total of 8,000 points. Now, Humanoid Worm Drake attack! Okay, you can wipe him out. Revival Gems! Go! Slifer! Annihilate him! Game over! Defeated by the Egyptian God card. Ooh, I got Morphin Jar. Nice. Okay, well that one's done. Next time will be the Dark Spirit review. Until next time, it's your boy Channel Tigger and Tyrant. Remember if you like to do it, please give it a like and subscribe to Uncharted Nation today. If you have a video impressed, just leave it in the comments of this video or on my Twitter feed at Channel 325. Also, let's put my friend Mel at Mel's Match at 7 for our wrestling know-how if you're into that sort of thing. Until next time, peace out.